the R35 Nissan GTR is being discontinued after 17 years. Nissan announced Friday that GTR production for the North American market will end in October with two special models, the Skyline and Takumi Edition, to celebrate the world-beating performance car. We've reached out to Nissan to confirm whether GTR production for other markets will continue beyond October and will update when we hear back. But even if the GTR remains in production after October, it certainly won't be for very long. The Skyline Edition builds on the Base E Premium Asia model and comes exclusively in Bayside Blue over Blue interior. Its price is $132,985. The Takumi Edition is a slightly modified version of the 2024 GTR T spec. It is painted exclusively in midnight purple and features sporty carbon ceramic brakes, gold rays forged wheels, and wider front fenders. The engine compartment features a gold VIN plate and red lettering on the exterior badges to honor Takumi, the master craftsman who built the GTR. Its price is $152,985. Both have the usual 3.8-liter twin-turbocharged V6 producing 565 horsepower, a six-speed dual-clutch transmission, and all-wheel drive. There is no information about the production numbers of these limited-edition models. The GTR shocked the performance car world when it debuted in 2007, punching well above its weight. He recreated the world in his image and forced many other automakers to work hard to defeat the killer Nissan. But in the years since, Nissan has struggled, and as performance cars have progressed, the GTR has received only repeated updates and two facelifts over the course of 17 years. While the R35 GTR leaves an unforgettable legacy, Nissan is now hyper-focused on the future and the next era of exciting innovations in performance, Shin Nissan said in a statement. Nissan showed off the Hyperforce, an electric GTR concept, but it might not arrive until the end of the decade.